time, I was a dancer in LA, just, you know, pounding the pavement. And um, eventually I moved into choreography and now I'm taking a leap into filmmaking. The biggest things people will know is that I've worked with Lady Gaga, Jennifer Lopez, Miley Cyrus, Zendaya, uh, when I did Euphoria. And I just recently did the musical theater episode of The L Word that's currently on Showtime. The thing that I enjoyed about Lady Gaga the most is her authenticity and her emotion. Because I think in order to be a great performer, you have to be deeply in tune with your emotions and that has to be able to resonate with an audience. And so I was always, even in the moments that I spent with her, was very taken aback by how emotionally available she is in her work. Baby, you understand me now. Black History Month to me, it, it means everything, but one can make the argument that it means nothing. Meaning that Black history is American history and then American history is history. That's also a reflection in my film. You know, even though there's racial tension, at some point there was a level of integration because in a lot of ways we have to respect our history, know that we are individuals and we are unique, but also acknowledge that we are all the same, we are all integrated and in not what we created and what we celebrate. Don't you know no one alive can always be an angel? Music was my first love and it will be my last. What do you think about that for you? No matter how big a film I direct or, you know, one day or, you know, where my career goes, I think in a lot of ways this short film reminded me of it that, you know, once you're a dancer, you're always a dancer. It's always there in your heart. Ooh.